Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Anki Codeverse. Today we will discuss about the Xcode tools. What is Xcode tools? Xcode tools is an integrated development environment developed by Apple for Mac OS. It provides a complete set of tools for developing software for Apple platforms, including Mac OS, iOS, iPad OS, Watch. OS, TV OS, and Audio OS. There are two types of categories development tools and deployment tools. Development tools these tools are used to write, test, and debug code. They include the code editor, debugger, simulator, and asset catalog editor. Deployment tools. These tools are used to build and deploy apps to device and platforms. They include the archiver, profiler, and distribution tools. Xcode has a variety of tools that can be used for different purposes. Here is a brief overview to some of the most commonly used tools such as top menu, side menu, right menu, and left menu. Top menu is File, Edit, View, Navigate, Run, Window, Helps. Files menu contains command for creating, opening, saving, closing and exploring projects. Edit menu contains command for editing code such as cut, copy, paste and undo. View menu contains command for customizing the appearance of Xcode window such as hiding and showing toolbars and inspectors navigate menu contains command for navigating through code such as jumping to the specific line and symbols run menu contains command for running and debugging apps such as building and deploying app to device and simulators Window menu contains commands for managing a window such as opening, closing and arranging windows. Help menu contains commands for getting help with Xcode such as viewing documentations and tu tutorials. Side menu. Side menu have project, libraries, debug area, console and issues. Projects shows the files and folder in your projects. Library that shows the classes, frameworks and other resources that you can use in your apps. Debugger area shows the state of your apps while it is running. Console area shows the output of your apps such as long messages and errors. Issues area shows any warnings and errors that were found in your codes. Right side menu such as help quick, assistant editor, source control, issues, navigators. Quick help shows documentations for the selected items. Assistant editor shows the source code for the selected item in a separate window. This shows the source controller status of the selected items. Version editor that shows the changes that have been made to the selected items. Issues navigator that shows any warnings of error that we are found in your codes. Left menu, editor, navigator, inspector and utility. Editor that shows the code editor where is you can add, edit your code. Navigator shows the project navigator, library navigator and debug area. Inspector shows the property of the selected items. Utility shows the debug navigator console and issues navigator. For the deeper understanding, you can visit the Apple developer documentations which display information like hide or show the navigator, double click to open the editor, click the open the editor, new window tabs, hide and show the inspector and other things. You can visit the below 
like add it to the, your source code and you can edit your code here you can visit the other options like jump bar jump bar menu to do fix me and mark and mini maps etc i also share the link in the de description box you can check in the below section you can visit the format and display the information as quick help with you view it like summary de declarations parameters through returns and declarations in etc thanks for watching i hope you have learned something new today if you have any questions please leave a comment in the section below don't forget to like share and subscribe